Cinderella lived with her stepmother and two stepsisters. They felt envious of her because she was sweet and beautiful. They forced her to work for them and do the hardest tasks. One day, the prince invited all the young girls of the kingdom to a dance offered by the prince in the palace, but her stepmother and stepsisters didn't allow her to go. Left alone, Cinderella, very sad, began to cry. At this time, her fairy godmother appeared and told her, You are a good girl, and you deserve to go to the dance. You will be able to go to the party. With a gesture, the fairy transformed her old clothes into the world's most beautiful dress. She took a pumpkin and made it a gorgeous carriage. You must not come back later than midnight. Otherwise, the magic will be broken, told the fairy. Cinderella went to the dance happily. Seeing her, the prince was fascinated by her beauty and they danced all night long. All the participants wondered who would be the lovely young girl. Neither her ugly stepsisters recognized her. Cinderella was so happy that she forgot what she had been told by the fairy godmother. She just remembered that when she heard the first chime of the clock that marked twelve o'clock. She left the palace running and lost one of her crystal shoes. The prince found it and announced that he would marry the girl in the kingdom who got the shoe belonged to her. Upon reaching the house of Cinderella, her stepsisters tried to but could not fit in the shoe. When it came to Cinderella's turn, she put it on perfectly. The prince and Cinderella, therefore, promised never to be separated. They swore eternal love and lived happily ever after. And they all lived happily ever after. <laughs>